small cameras liberated me in a way because of my style of photography, which is sort of off kilted. And for me, I could be really free with it and sort of dance, dance with the camera, you know. It's a small, I always see what I'm shooting here, so I'm not shooting blind. And I don't have to bring it to my eyes. And um, I think, you know, and also the ISO is amazing. It's a high, it's a high ISO, 1600, and it's absolutely fabulous. So uh, I can get a good, good shots, even in a, in a you know relatively dark environment, and that suits me fine, because I don't like to use strobe, uh, because I like to create, the, I like to keep the ambiance of the of the environment I'm working in, and also the Canon has created has made this incredible. Uh, watertight mm -hmm. underwater casing for it which is completely incredible and very easy to use and very accurate and it's not really cranky so I could work on the boat on a Zodiac with all the water splashing around and uh, I got a lot of good results so that was a great exp it was my first big experience with this G10 and then I took it to um, Darfur where you know it's very difficult to photograph because all the authorities hate journalists and hate photographers, and so I've, I've done a lot of interesting, interesting things there with it, just working, and uh, and now I just came back from Caucasus, Caucasus, you know, Ossetia and places like that where I also used it a lot, and it was completely incredible, you know.